Hi, my name is Tim Benison, and I'm the executive producer of Prototype. Today we'll be talking about the story of the game. What drives the narrative? What are the motivations of the characters? And really, what is underpinning the over-the-top action that is the essence of this game? So the basic premise behind the story is that Alex Mercer, the main character, wakes up on a slab in a morgue with some scientists hovering above him, about to cut him open in an autopsy. Now obviously, his first goal is to get the heck out of there and uh, get out of that incredibly traumatic situation. But the character and the player quickly discover that Alex has no memories. So the rest of the game is about why he ended up on that morgue slab, how he got his shape-shifting powers, who did this to him, and basically getting his revenge. He can consume anyone he meets in New York City. One of the things he gets from consuming people is memories. They may have some knowledge of some piece of the puzzle, some, some knowledge of your past life. It's the player is literally piecing these together into something we call the Web of Intrigue interface. It's a really unique way of telling a story, and I think it's one that plays really well into the interactivity of a game. Dana Mercer, who is Alex's sister, is one of the other major characters in the game. She's a journalist and she helps Alex find answers. She's got access to certain sources of information, but she doesn't have all of the answers. This hunter you're looking for seems to Another major ally of Alex is Dr. Ragland. Now he's a pathologist at a local hospital, and he has specialized knowledge of the infection that's sweeping through New York City. Alex needs his help in fighting the military and even in combating some of the specialized weapons that the military deploy against him. One of the main enemy characters in the game that Alex squares off against is the Specialist. Now he's a leader in the Black Watch, which is a special branch of the US military whose main purpose is to contain and stamp out infections, especially in large urban environments like the one that's happening in New York City. Nothing phases him, nothing surprises him when it comes to the effects of biological warfare. And he's probably one of the toughest enemies Alex will face in the game. One of the most important characters in Prototype is in fact the city itself. New York evolves over time before your eyes as the story unfolds. The buildings themselves become infected. In fact, some of them we call hives, and these things are the core of the infection, and they actually can spew out hordes of infected. It's really cool to see them come out of these giant pustules. Not only do you see infected zones, you also see heavily militarized zones with bases being set up and lots more military hardware being transported. The main thing we want the player to feel is the feeling that they're the ultimate badass. Alex Mercer is one of the most powerful video game characters ever created. It's a revenge quest, so we want players to feel like they're getting to the heart of the conspiracy that made them the way they are, and making those responsible pay. 